pay a cash award of up to $2,000 for information on these or any unsolved crimes. It's a organization like Crime Stoppers that can assist. I don't know what makes people tick that would do something as senseless as this. The crime occurred at a condo building located at 1310 14th Avenue Southwest. It was Tuesday, October 30th when a 27-year-old Oriental male was walking along the alleyway at the back of his residence. He was walking down intending to go into the door here and as he walked down he recognized a vehicle that was on the side there with three uh, male black occupants. He thought it was sort of strange but nothing too threatening at the time and just continued on his way and as he swiped into the door he heard uh, an engine revving behind him. Uh, he looked behind to see the vehicle had now come up right behind him and two of the occupants have got out of the vehicle and were chasing him into the building. He was going to try to pull the door shut behind him, but it was too late. Two of the occupants of the vehicle came into the building and one of them uh, produced a 45 caliber handgun and took one shot at him. Fortunately, it missed him and was embedded in a drywall on the other side of the building. Uh, the victim then managed to uh, make his escape through the building. The victim did suffer only minor injuries. As this surveillance video shows, if the victim didn't fall while he was trying to get away, there's a very high chance the bullet would have hit him. After the victim was chased away, the shooter then picked up his cell phone and keys that had fallen to the ground. He then walked out. Investigators are unsure of the exact motive of this crime, and it's also unknown if the victim knew any of the suspects. The victim is in the second-hand car business and he has a business partner who is known to Calgary Police Service and would be of interest to the people who committed this crime. Um, we are thinking at the moment this may be a case of mistaken identity. Um, it's possible that the people, the suspects in this case, believed that the victim was his business partner and, and targeted him for that reason. Police are looking for three black male suspects. The suspect that is in question for the shooting is described as six feet tall with a heavy build. Now, some witnesses have come forward to police. However, it hasn't helped with further investigation. Now, Crime Stoppers could pay a cash award of up to $2,000 for information on this or any unsolved crime, the recovery of stolen property, drugs, or the arrest of any wanted person. Your tips are anonymous and completely confidential. You can talk, type, or text them in. For SHOT TV, I'm Lisa Walansky.